Good morning. So today I am actually altering a top, so a little bit of alterations. I've got this kind of look, Greek looking top here that's had these at the shoulders and it's been attached through the area at the shoulder, um, shoulder seams. And what I've been doing, because I don't like this and it's very uncomfortable on the shoulder, I'm going to take that and I'm going to, so what I've had to do is cut it because it's metal. I'm going to put through this bit here, either something like rat's tail, either black, which is this one, or the colored one. Not that you're gonna see that much of it, but uh, rat's tail is rolled ribbon done really tightly on a machine but it's really nice it's quite strong you can have it in necklaces you can do it as loops down the back of a dress um, especially like sort of wedding dresses they have it in and I thought I would use something like that so the whole thing of trying to get this done and I've been um, well, I suppose I've been working on it a bit but it just shows with trying to maneuver things and trying to get things done and trying to get it cut so just using these are a pair of um, little pliers and trying to cut the metal quite really strong stronger than my hands will allow me but it does eventually cut as or maybe that one was a fluke that one could have been a fluke trying to undo it. And what I will do is I won't necessarily throw these away. I might add them into a piece of artwork or art textiles, whatever I work on. Let's try and get that open. Does it get in there? I think it's getting there very tiny. But I thought I'd show because how to adapt something and then get it through I'll use a large needle like a tapestry needle that's not pointed so quite hard to do as she's trying to cut this making sure I get it I got them the right way let's try that on that way instead might be a bit easier So anything that sometimes designers use to be creative, I really, really liked this top when I originally got it, which was some years ago, but I haven't really worn it because these metal parts, I don't know, I just, I mean, I just didn't really, it didn't really grab me that I really liked it. Was it I remember saying it in the shop, I love the design, but didn't like the metal bits there we go there we go it's come out so now I'm just going to take that and put that just moving that all out of there okay so I haven't yes it may have been an easier way to undo it from there but I don't um, like working with stretch material. Um, stretch material on me ends up distorting, which in fact, if you look at that seam, I don't know if you can see that, that is distorted because they've had problems rolling it. Well, while that one is a little bit of a twisted seam, this one is a better seam, but it's still got a twist in it. It's because it's cut it's stretching it's stretching it's not getting very far so I just wanted to show that today um, of things that you can repair so sometimes people look at clothes and just chuck them out um, there's this big thing about recycling clothes and I always think it's really nice to try and make it into something different which is um, what I'm doing with something else I'm working on so that's it for today. Thank you.